Being on daddy duty means cooking, cleaning, sometimes means being a hairstylist, but not everybody is as good as this dad. Take a look. I'm almost done. Get you do great. Oh, baby, thank you so much. You're so encouraging to dad. <laughs> Joining us this morning to help dads avoid hair raising drama, the Hollywood hair guy himself, Dean Vanowitz. Dean, thank you so much for coming in, buddy. Thanks for having me. Listen, I just want to get this, you know, your tagline is <laughs> one head at a time, right? Changing lives one head at a time. All right, so listen, before what we get into that, let me, let me introduce you to the gang here. I want to start down there. What's your name, sir? Uh, Saul. And your daughter? Isabella. Isabella. Dan. Dan. And Christina. And Christina. Satyan. And Leela. And that's Leela right there. All right, so listen, what are the tools every good dad needs to get the kids' hair done? Well, to start with, I come from a family of 15. Okay. So, 15? You know, yes. The 77 nieces and nephews, okay. they are always complaining. My sisters and sister in laws constantly complaining because the guys aren't helping <laughs> raise the girls. We can't do it. Man. So, I love this because this is a great starter kit. It's just a little toolbox full of accessories. Nice. And, you know, kind of, you know, with dads, you got to start basic, okay. right? So, we start with the just a basic. Yeah. Yeah, ponytail. Show me how to do the ponytail. Well, and the ponytail, and we've been working on this because, you know, he's very honest. He said he's never done it before. Right, right. Never so it. The, the, the whole key is to see how he's scooping it into his hands. Mm -hmm. Really important. Mm -hmm. Now, remember, your first ponytails aren't going to be the best, but the bonding with your child yes. is going to be amazing. I'm good at the scoop also. I could just never right? do the ponytail. Wait, so when you're, when you're like this, he did a great job, and you just scoop it all together. Right, right. And you have your ponytail tie, mm -hmm. and it's quick and it's easy. We always do a couple of little pieces. Yeah. And now, you know, a lot of dads really struggle with just trying to make it look perfect. Yeah. And it's okay if it's not perfect. It's okay if it's a little messy because she's going to know that daddy did it. How, what do you do? What do you do? What do you do when they start? What do you do when they start crying? Well, there's no tears. I mean, I, I, I'm really against bribing, but yeah. if you got it, you got it. Yeah. Right? Does, it, does your daddy do your hair? No. No, not, not, not You're going to let him do your hair? Yeah. Okay, okay, nice. Perfect. So once once the ponytail is in, yes, yes. Um, then we have to learn how to braid. You gotta go braid. Show me the braid. Now I show people how to braid using the cables on the back of the TV because there's three and they're color coded. Okay. And it's manly <laughs> to try and braid it out. Right. And this is what you practice on before you actually go to your daughter's hair. Okay. Because practice makes perfect. Because I'm telling you, you mess up once, she's not going to let you. We're all okay. we're all good at hooking up the TV cables, right. but the braiding is where the, that's <laughs> right. the hard part. So once you have once you have this ponytail in. Mm -hmm. You start to work on the braid. Okay. So you split the ponytail into three pieces. Uh -huh. And I'm just going to put this in really quickly. I love that we matched her ponytail with her outfit. Very easy. Makes it look so easy, doesn't he, yeah, guys? Does. Right. Yeah. Very so easy. And just break it into three Show pieces. Off. It's what we do. Three pieces. Okay. Oh, you're not you're not out of the window. Uh, okay. Friend. Three pieces, <laughs> Here, I'll gentlemen. Take, I'll take the brush. Just split it into three. Three oh, pieces, once like those have, cables. Yeah. Once you have your three pieces, the outside goes into the center. Awesome. Now this one goes in. Perfect. And once you practice on those cables, you're doing a great job. This guy's doing great. Look, Look at this. He's like speed demon. <laughs> you see what's going on with your dad there? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Well, and the other thing, too, that a lot of guys have trouble with Go ahead. is really understanding the difference between, you know, a hairpin mm -hmm. and an actual bobby pin. Yes. So a bobby pin is really great to anchor. And then once you have your braid, it, love it because you can actually just twist this around. Here, we hold that for me That's, and hold this It looks for so me. easy. But the other thing, if you want to be a bougie dad, you can take and you can actually just tug each one of those little sections. It makes it into a fat, fun braid because then you can actually loop this around mm -hmm. and start to create a braided bun. Ah, that's when princess you, book. Yeah. All right, exactly. let's see. We got one more trick. So then once you have this bun put together, now let's say we want to make it rock solid because mm -hmm. she's going to be going to a little dance recital. Okay. Can I that pin from you? Thanks, ma'am. So once you put this in, here's a great tip for dads. Get a little hairnet, lock it in, nice. and secure it. This isn't going to go anywhere when she's doing her pirouettes across the board. <laughs> Isabella, right. you're looking very sharp down there. <laughs> All right, Dean Banowitz, thanks for sharing your styling tips with us. Dean also has the book, The Dean's List of Daddy Dues. Dean, where can they get this book? Amazon. Amazon, of course, everything at Amazon. And thanks to the New York City Dads Group helping us track down all these wonderful dads and their daughters. Ladies, have a great holiday. Happy Hanukkah, Merry Good Christmas, job. the whole deal, all right?